So I want to say this. I've recently been transitioned to be with my brother, and I am immensely grateful to the warden for being courageous to set right a long-standing wrong. That said, there has been a huge misunderstanding about this reunion. Those who attack my wife and demean her posts and accounts attack me and are, frankly, blind. The reality is, is that the transition to this, this new facility and, and finally being with Lyle again, it has not been easy or without significant challenges. Let's not live in a fairy tale. There's no reason to live in a fairy tale. Uh, apart this call and your telephone number will be monitored and recorded. Lyle and I are brothers, but uh, we, we've also experienced a, ch uh, a childhood of, of sometimes severe and overwhelming trauma and heartache. And, and as a result, Lyle and I carry a special bond. We love each other. But we're also brothers who have just experienced 20 years of forced separation, unable to, to, to even see one another. And this, this transition has sometimes been very rocky. We have argued and not gotten along well sometimes as we, we, we revisit a really a painful past, traumatic past. And, and we, we're doing it from the perspective of adults now and not from, not, not as, as the kids that we were. And so a, a brother's bond is special, but it's not written in stone. It requires a lot of work in healing and support and love and understanding. And, and let's not pretend that such a reunion will not be without real difficulty, uh, just as it's not without joy. Uh, I've never told anyone that Lyle and I are getting along without difficulty, such has been posted on Lyle's page. And as of yet, I, I haven't even discussed that matter with, or any of this with, with my Aunt Jonia. And it is, it is hugely disruptive and saddening to me that other people, including people who, 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 who say they love and support me and, and, and my family will take one side over the other and support one of us against the other. When people go on Lyle's page and simply support him or denigrate my wife, a woman who has stood by my side and sacrificed for me for all of these years, really been there through thick and thin and through hardship and never wavered, and they denigrate her or badmouth her or who badmouth the administrators of the page, they, it's the same thing as attacking me. I see it as attacking me and denigrating me and, and being bullying and vicious directly to me. There's no other way to see it. So let's not pretend that you can, you, it can be otherwise because the, the, the truth is plain to see. And when people simply support Lyle and, and, and choose not to support me, then, then that, that, that's, that's clear as well. It's, it's just the reality of life. Uh, it's not, it's, there's no illusion. I don't want to uh, pretend that it's any other way. I see what it is. Uh, to the people who, who, who truly care about me and support me, I say this. I say a new and, and bright path of healing really needs to begin. This bickering is beneath us all. None of these comments, none of the comments that include uh, malicious, divisive statements should be permitted to remain, and they're not going to remain on my page. And frankly, I think that all such comments and posts should be taken down across the board. I think the future is ours to create, and I want to create one with Tammy and me and my supporters uh, of, of happiness and joy. And, and so I thank you. I thank you for supporting me, my wife, and my family, and my best to you all.